So how is it going, Dank Division? Dank Dan here, and we're here to discuss at least the Vanguard multiplayer side of this festive holiday thing that we've been seeing. And I'm going to be talking you through pretty much the most efficient way to go about this, because let's face it, some of us have day jobs. Some of us have kids. A lot of us do not have enough time in the day to waste screwing around to get all this stuff done. So I'm going to break it down for you as efficiently as I can, tell you what order to focus on, and hopefully you guys can walk away with this weapon blueprint that surprisingly has led me onto an LMG that I didn't think I'd be using. So let's start off with where you should start. The first place you should probably start is with shipment. Complete 15 matches on shipment. Nice, simple, cut and dry. Now why do you want to start with this one? Nice and simple, you're going to want to go on the ship miss 24-7. Now, why is that? Because all these other challenges can be completed just by playing shipment. Now, why do I say that? Because once you complete the 15 matches of shipment, odds are you will have completed at least one, two, maybe even three matches of Armageddon. How that works is just play the game mode and how that game mode works. It's like Drop Zone from Modern Warfare 3. Collect cat care packages... Use them to pretty much kill your enemies. Nice and simple. What's better yet is when you're playing Armageddon, that opens up your door to being able to get kills with kill streaks. If you happen to get lucky and you end up playing Shipment and Armageddon at the same time, odds are you can now complete three at the exact same time. So moving on. Opening the five care packages. Now you've got it that all four, if they line up correctly, you're doing four at the same time. Now this one, this one's the tricky one. Kill 10 Elf Team 6 members hiding in multiplayer maps. So here's something you want to remember. They spawn in in the exact same places every single time. They will respawn in the exact same places every single time. So your best bet is to stay on shipment and start paying attention to where they spawn in because once you memorize where these little bastards spawn in, you can use that to your advantage and have it that early on in the match before the chaos gets really nuts. You can snag one, two, maybe even three of these little bastards before you're really into the match and can keep chugging along. The toughest one, at least on this side of the fence, is eliminating Krampus three times. Now I'm going to be perfectly honest. He is not easy to kill regardless of which side of the fence you're on. But what I have found is that if you get a few shots off on him and someone else finishes the job, you get credit for eliminating Krampus. So don't focus on eliminating Krampus as your main objective, because if you do, you're going to get a major headache. Literally just go in order backwards, going shipment, which could lead to Armageddon completions, which could lead to, of course, getting the kill streaks, the care packages, killing Elf Team 6, and if you're lucky couple of Krampus kills, and might I add, this LMG is surprising me, the Type 11, 90 rounds, and if you tinker with this thing enough, you can get the recoil low enough? I'm not saying it's a meta, by any means, but I am saying that this gun, it packs a few surprises. And with that being said, Hopefully this helps out anyone who's strapped for time and trying to figure out how to go about completing this. So if this was helpful to you, don't forget to drop a subscribe, leave a like, and comment down below. Have you completed this event and what are your thoughts on it as a whole? And if you don't have Vanguard, be on the lookout because at some point later you're going to see another video, likely the next day, detailing how to go about completing the Warzone side of it. So with that being said, you guys have a wonderful day, night, whatever you're doing, do it wholeheartedly. And of course, as always, this is Dank Dan, signing off. Get them to hit that subscribe button, Dank. It's the only way we can figure out the numbers. What do the numbers mean, Dank? We're wasting valuable time.